Hey, let's just welcome back. Hopefully it was a restful, longer weekend that you had here. Um, we are jumping into Unit 11, the Civil War. It's gonna be the same seats, actually, because Unit 10 was so short, same seats that we've had uh, going forward here. Unit 10 tests, not a lot of people got it finished, but it did get put into the grade book. So grade should be up to date, still working a little bit on the nine and a half project. Those will get in uh, soon. Today, uh, follow along on the slides of daily activities, support your team, support your team, work hard and be nice, flow your water, first and seventh course, you know you're on chairs and cords, everybody should be checking their emails. New hashtag is NEI11, um, so we're in Unit 11, the Civil War, phones still don't exist. Uh, and our new bit.ly is going to be 30-2750-F, uh, so kind of a, an interesting one there. That'll be updated onto the door as well. Photo credits for this unit, of course, photos are pulled from Yahoo Image Search. You guys know that. I have been doing that pretty consistently. The homework menu is live. The study guide is also currently available to you, even though the quiz is a few weeks out. I just wanted to make sure that all those materials are available to you. Here's a take a look at the uh, agenda, the, the tentative schedule for this, this particular unit. Um, we are going to be on Civil War vocab and background today, April 18th. Um, and then going on to Civil War Armies tomorrow. You can see the rest of the calendar kind of coming through there. Uh, so our standards for this unit, Civics 3, compare the means by which individuals and groups of societies can promote the common good and protect rights. History 1, analyze connections among events and developments in broader historical contexts. History 2, analyze multiple factors that influence the perspectives of people during different historical eras. And History 4, compare the central historical arguments and secondary works across multiple media. You know those in regular language. Let's go ahead and get on to today. It's Civil War vocab. To take care of yourself and one another, stay safe, wash your hands. If you choose, wear a mask. We love you.